Okay, here I am at um, the boys category, and you'll notice that the template list in Commerce Composer shows one template, and it's actually being used for boys, women, men, and girls. So let's go ahead and go out to the website. And we'll start off on women's. So what we're going to do is we're just going to navigate around. Let's go to uh, boys. You'll notice it's very different content. And we'll go to girls. Same thing, different content in only two areas. And then if we go to men, we can see that it has three different areas and it's all uh, men content. So if we come back in here and now we look at this layout, what I want to show you is how to use the eSpot um, e-marketing spot widget uh, to accomplish this. So basically, we had the traditional uh, headers and footers and then the left nav here, um, but what was, very, what was very different was the content in uh, slot four and slot six. So let's go ahead and sort this and look at these different um, e-spots. So you'll notice the first one in four is just a heading widget, so that's not really what we're looking for. And this is an e-marketing spot widget here. And you can see that it is set up as a page-specific e-marketing spot, uh, not a common one. So what this means is for each page that, is, that this layout is assigned to, a unique e-marketing spot will be generated with a name that follows this format, the page name and then the suffix. So our suffix is row one content. So the actual e-marketing spot would be, for instance, men row one content, women row one content, girls row one content. And if I come over to uh, the marketing list, we can see that. So we've got men row one content, we've got men row three categories and men row four cat entries. And this is the specific marketing rule uh, that puts that out there for the men's category. So once again, the whole purpose is to show that this e-marketing spot widget uh, can have dynamic content um, throughout different sections of the page uh, if you wish to have it. So that concludes the video. Thanks for watching.